Hey guys, quick short video today, but I wanted to break down some of Frank Nilakina's performance in the FIBA World Cup. FIBA World Cup started yesterday. Check out our last video where we kind of go in on all the teams and what to expect. Take note. Big Beach. We're here. I'm bad now, it's just Okay, it's different this time. But it sounds like you're rich in town. France will play in Germany in this one. France are the favorite, but Germany had a pretty decent game. France started off on an insane, like, 14 to nothing run. The defense on France is pretty incredible. Rudy Gobert obviously have the defensive player of the year, so you have the best guy at the rim in the entire tournament. And Nicholas Batum and Frank Nilakina and these guys, they can really pop in there and give you some good defense as well. So it's going to be tough for teams to score on them. As for Frank specifically, some good and some bad. Well, I mean, kind of just, you know, up and down. You know how Frank is. So we get some really nice shooting today, at least from the perimeter. Two for two from deep. Uh, looked consistent, looked comfortable. Hit his two shots early. Um, on defense, he was decent, but he did have a little bit of trouble with Dennis Schroeder's speed. Uh, that guy is blazing fast and he got past Frank a couple of times, but Frank also got him a, little, a couple of times as well and rotated well um, uh, In terms of like just general aggressiveness getting to the rim. We have this insane play here. Yep That is actually Frank Nilekina. Um Wow Imagine if he can finish that someday in the NBA and other than that, you know France he only played 13 minutes France were pretty solid overall. They went to the vets late Frank did start this game on the bench, but he will play more as time goes on. But pretty solid win for them in the end, even though they slipped up late and really let Germany get back in the game. But in FIBA, you really can't lose. These games are so important. You only play three group stage games before you decide, before you basically go on or not. So a big win for France today. So you'll be seeing more of Frank in the tournament as time goes on. But that was where he was today. Decent performance, you know, at least the shooting. That's and that's a big thing for him. He hit those two shots, looked comfortable. Missed a couple more inside. But if he's hitting his three alone, that's going to make him a much better player overall. All right, guys. Peace.